Good morning, guys. We are here at FU to interview members of the Student Council organization about their daily lives. We're going to ask them and find out about what are their goals, what they like most about being at the Student Council, and more. Do you find student council amusing? Uh, yes, of course, because student student council is a very good institution or organization to be with because you can know uh, a lot of people, especially their characters. So you can socialize with them. And lastly, for that question, uh, student council is a great with a great uh, way to have a good character to other people, especially those who don't have any organization for now. So it's a good way to have a uh, uh, build a uh, great what do you call it? Yung parang yung parang ano maganda yung at positive ka to other person and you build uh, confidence kasi to have to face other challenges uh, balancing study and work ano siya just imagine you're like in a corporate world uh, if you have a uh, you have a part time job aside working in a corporation, ganun siya. It's hard. For example, if you're a professor, a uh, part-time professor in a school, and you're a full-time uh, worker in a corporation, ganun din yun. Like, uh, for us, it's more on you enhance your personal skills in the student council. And iba yung sa, sa study. So you you have you you need to balance it 50-50, 60-40, but you prioritize your study first. Because in dito it's just an extracurricular. Remember that it's just an extra or uh, extracurricular for me and for us here. So yun lang yung difference niya. So always remember that you all uh, study first then you prioritize the other extracurricular. Achieving you, achieving you, 
achieved so far as a student council? Uh, actually, I'm uh, I'm my first year. I'm only new for the association for the student organization. This my um greatest achievement. Uh, for me, it's a learning process for me eh, because until now we're not yet done for uh in the sports phase. But for me, it's the it is the greatest achievement because from the previous uh, sports phase, it's different from now. Eh. The sports phase now is more organized than the past. So for me, that's the great this achievement that I can say for now even though I am a new newbie here in the student council <clears throat> what advice would you give to people who are planning to join the student council advice to give uh, uh, pursue your uh, no, pursue your First, pursue what you want. Because here's a student council. You need. Uh, it's not about the study. It's about having a uh, a family. It's like a family here. Because uh, for me, because I joined here because I have experienced it in the previous uh, level high school. So I have an idea of having this kind of organization so my advice is continue it don't stop if you're if you're a student council in the past don't stop and don't be ano, don't be shy don't be afraid of what will happen here because you will be you will benefit from it eh those in those things na malalaman mo mm. from the seniors you will benefit from it and you can apply it in the future. This challenge you faced so far as a student council and how were you able to overcome it? Mm. Um, first of all, I'm not, uh, I'm not a... I'm a partisan, non-partisan person here at the student council. So the biggest challenge is how you communicate to others, especially those now who are running for the, the election. It's hard because some of them are your friends and that's the biggest problem that, uh, that I encountered as of now. Uh, you know naman na the, the election is coming, na di ba? So it's hard for us, those non-partisan, to uh, Communicate with them, especially if you have a tighter bond as a friend. Minabuna kayo. That's hard. So, what I do is uh, just the normal, the normal pacing of a friend. Yung pacing nyo na it's equal to all. Because you have a friend from the other side, you have a friend from the other side. So, you need to be equal for. For them. for them so that's the biggest way you can do to overcome a problem right. mm. in high school I'm a president of the uh, sports uh, sports organization then I became a I became a commanding officer of the CAT. Then I started joining student council last year because of that things also. You have the dedication to do respon the responsibilities. Uh, you have the knowledge to share to them. And it's a new way it's a new way in a kind of ikaw pumasok ka and you're a new you're a new person, and you're, new, you're a new product to them, so you can give a wider knowledge. That's why I joined here. And also to, know, to enhance also my skills and for being an 
introvert to overcome that to be an extrovert. What are your goals as a student counselor? For me, <laughs> for me, goals, I, I don't usually use, I don't usually have goals for that. For me, the day-to-day, -day, the day-to-day -day, uh, process for me is that, that is my goal, to be productive and not to aim for what uh, not to aim for a higher goal that's why I I don't even set a goal it's it's okay to set a goal for this day only that you can give for the organization not for the future because you can have a mishap say that's why I don't usually set a goal for that that's all. That's all. What do you think is the greatest thing about being a student council and why? Greatest thing? The people, I say. Greatest thing. If you're an ex introvert person, yun yung pinakama sarap sa isang person who is only in one comfort zone and you. And now you're in a variety of ane. That's the greatest thing for me. Say, you have you you compress yourself in one place. Now, maybe may other person na and dito you get na ay paghalubilo ka. You can chat with them, and they give you motivation. The greatest thing for me is that I that I communicate with them. For being an extrovert, I became ah from an introvert, I became an extrovert because of the, yung bang, you have the, bata, lakas na loob to overcome some mishaps, challenges. Hi, thank you, thank you. Hi, wag niyo lang si Ate ha, si Sir. Thank you. Oh my God! Do you find the student council amusing? If yes, how? If no, why? Uh, yes, I find the student council amusing since I get to experience a lot of things um, not offered to ordinary students. I mean, only offered to student leaders. I get to experience to um, to join um, some leadership programs that doesn't just um, held here in Manila but in the other parts of the Philippines. So I, I really enjoy um, being part of the student council aside, because aside from those um, outside experiences, I get to also um, meet new people, meet different people here in FEU, um, not just here in FEU but also outside, meet um, corporate persons and like. How do you balance your your time studying while working as a student counselor? Um, for me, it's just a matter of knowing your priorities. Because if you know your priorities, you know where to act first, you, and you can allocate your time properly. Kasi kapag alam mo yung priority mo, alam mo kung ano yung mga isa-sacrifice mo, hindi magiging mahirap sa'yo isipin kung ano, alin sa mga bagay yung unahin mo. And um, madalas kasi kapag sa student council ka plus student ka, ang madalas na sacrifice talaga is your time with your friends and um, tulog talaga. So if you know how to sacrifice your time with your friends and tulog, much better kasi nagkakaroon ka ng time, nagkakaroon ka ng time na mag nagkakaroon ka ng time sa pag-aaral, mas maraming time sa pag-aaral and mas maraming time sa SC. And most of the time din naman ang mga nagiging kaibigan mo na is yung mga nasa SC. So it's just a matter of setting your priorities, knowing your priorities. You do not have to go um, much sa student council. Basta kailangan alam mo lang kung ano yung mga trabaho ang kaya mong gawin. What is the greatest achievement you achieved so far as a student council? Well, for me, 
Um, this year kasi, ang um, in charge sa akin as the vice president is first is the policy making. I have to create a policy na hindi lang basta gawa, pero back, back up siya ng research, back up by literature. So, yun, yun yung isa sa, I think, yun yung mga significant na nagawa ko this year is the policy making. Next is the community development project. The community development project, isa siya sa mga gusto ko kasi nailapit ko siya sa course ko. So, parang hindi lang ako nag-isip ng basta community development project to help. Pero inilapit ko siya sa course ko. Yun yung pinaka nagustuhan ko regarding sa community development project. And yung dalawang yun, very essential siya sa, sa success and existence ng student council. So, I think yun yung dalawang significant contribution ko so far as a student leader. Okay. So, what advice will you give to people who are planning to join the Student Council? Um, advice ko sa mga gustong sumali sa Student Council. Alamin niyo kung ano yung contribute niyo sa Student Council. Kung hindi niyo pa man alam, sumali lang kayo sa Student Council. Kasi malay niyo, dun niyo malaman. Kasi ganun din naman ako nang nagsastart ako. Gusto ko lang tumulong. Gusto ko lang ng membership. Gusto ko lang umatend ng mga seminar. Gusto ko lang maranasan, magtrabaho sa team, sa isang organization. Kasi alam kong magagamit ko yun kapag nagtrabaho na ako. Which is true. Dahil nag, nga nag-OJT na kami. So yun, itry niyo lang mag uh, magkahit anong org dito sa FEU. Marami namang org dyan. Um, kasi doon nyo malalaman kung ano yung magiging purpose ninyo sa, sa isang organization na sasalihan ninyo. And magagamit ninyo in the future. So yun lang. Next! What is the greatest wow. challenge <laughs> you face so far as a student council? How did you overcome it? Greatest challenge? Yeah. Greatest challenge talaga para sa akin is yung time management. Kasi yun nga, um, not to brag, kasi di ba yung accountancy program, internal auditing program talaga, kahit saang school naman siya, mahirap talaga siya, tapos sasabayan mo pa ng extracurricular activities. Uh, medyo, minsan iiyak ka na lang, hindi dahil naiiyak ka, pero may prof na magpapaiyak sa'yo kasi parang, yan yan, yan na lang ang iniintindi mo, ganun. Uh, mahirap talaga siyang isabay sa accountancy, talagang hating-hati ka. Um, ako ang madalas ginagawa ko, Kapag nasa school at kaya, SC lang talaga. Kapag nasa bahay ako, walang SC. Talagang aral lang ako. So yun, yun talaga yung challenge para sa akin. Pagsabayin yung accounting program and SC. Bakit <laughs> <laughs> yun naman ito, Tipe? No, Next question. What made you join the student council? Ah, medyo mahirap yan. Kasi to be honest, Joining the student council, being an officer of the student council, hindi naman yun yung mag apply po ako, gusto ko pong maging part ng officer ng student council. You have to run for election kasi dyan. So, um, siguro yung bakit na lang ako nag-org. Bakit ako nag-org? Kasi gusto ko nga maranasan, uh, ma-experience how to work with the team, how to work in an organization, experience what is it like to um, create project, to create events, to propose a policy. I want to know how so that in the future when I work, meron ako ma-offer sa future employer ko. And added skill din yun sa akin. Kasi um, naniniwala ako na hindi naman lahat ng bagay natututunan lang sa classroom. You have to explore, um, i-grab mo yung mga opportunity na mag-grab mo dito sa FEU. Especially tayo sa FEU least ang expectation sa atin. So, um, if you join organization, alam mo sa sarili mo na meron kang skill, may edge ka with the others. So, yun. Yun lang. What are your goals as a student council? Goals as the student council. Student council officer or the goals of the student council? Student council. Ah, the goals of the student council is of course to promote um, professional growth to the IAB of students, yes. to promote volunteerism, to promote youth active participation in different social issues, not just here in the Far Eastern University, in the Institute of Accounts, Business and Finance, but moreover at large in the Philippine um, sector. Um, 
the idea of student council's role is to be um, the helping hand of the Institute of Accounts, Business and Finance Academic Office. Uh, Mag-reach out sa mga students na hindi nare-reach. Um, tumulong in any way that we know from proper dissemination of information up to um, sending grievances to the Far Eastern University and alike. Yun yung mga goal na student council. And every year, yun yung we work out na ma-reach and matap ng student council. So last question. What do you think is the greatest thing about being a student council and why? Uh, ano ba? The greatest thing about being a student council member, it's the experience, it's the journey, it's the people around the student council that makes the great difference on being part of the student council. All right. I will not further elaborate the answer. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Saya naman? Isa pa, round two. <laughs> nice work, nice work. Oh, thank you, brother. Brail ba yan? Ay, Brail. Anong year mo na? Second year. Saan ito nakuha? <laughs> Sa school mo nung high school? Sa so, manawag. Ah, manawag. Hi, hey, brother. Hello. I'm Char. You are? De Daniel. Daniel, hello. Ikaw ang pangalan mo. Brav. <laughs> nice. Ikaw, <Nice>. Nats. <laughs> yes, kuya. Al, al lang. <laughs> Henry? Henry? Ano mo naman pangalan niyo? Ano? Photo of?